Howdy gang, welcome back to this week's episode of the Narnia Circus at Home. <laughs> Quarantine, week number, I don't even know what week it is right now. But I've been thinking about fun things to do. When I was much younger, my dad and I used to build model trains all the time. And it was an awesome gift spending this wonderful time with my father, who is the most exceptional man. He showed me with these model trains how you can have an idea in your mind and you can make it real. See, modeling things does something amazing for an idea that's just in your head. It forces you to get it out there into the world in some way, even if it's small, uh, like a model, a scale model. But for me in my circus dreams, those adventures with my father from years before, they became very, very uh, useful and important because uh, I started out wanting to make a great big circus. And uh, then I discovered some very crucial facts, which were, I didn't have any money. Um, uh, so I couldn't just go out and buy the thing I wanted to do. I needed to find a way to make my dream uh, but using the stuff that I actually had or could get my hands on or could convince someone to lend me uh, And so that's why the idea of the mini big top was born Because I had to start somewhere and it turns out that you can actually be small and be incredibly impactful in in your community uh, in, in the world That's why I thought it might be a really cool reason to uh, build the mini big top with you or at least show you how uh, I did it I did a version of it we're gonna do an updated version right now uh, but then you can you can take this idea and make your own circus that's really the point uh, here's a lineup of what you're going to need to build the mini big top What up, party people? Welcome to the Circus Workshop. I just said like a whole bunch of stuff and I realized that the recording thing was not on. Jeez Louise! There's a quote by uh, Theodore Roosevelt, he's attributed as saying, uh, do what you can with what you have where you are. And I think that that is meaningful to me and, and I think particularly like at this moment right now, because a lot of folks, myself included, and I'm probably you, feel powerless in a way. But, well, sometimes reality hands you a situation and you can either be upset that it isn't going the way that you hoped it was going to go, uh, or scared, or or uh, worried, or angry, or you can do what uh, Teddy Roosevelt is suggesting with this little quote, which is that you make the best of the situation you find yourself in, and you 
uh, don't let it stop you from trying to find some way to make the world, the people around you, yourself a little happier, a little better. Uh, look out for more amazing adventures in the weeks to come. Other things may be going crazy in the world, but I'm going to keep showing up with this video series and something to make you smile. <laughs> So I want to leave you with a little bit of aerial drone footage from back in 2014 so you can see the very first time the mini bid top went into uh, existence. Until then, sending lots of love to all, and I'll see you down the road. Bye-bye, everybody. You and I.